Good evening. Hi, it's Drew. Good evening. Hello, good Hi. evening. Hello, good evening. Mario Jose. Hello, Delbert. Hello. Sir, uh, I'm on my way to to home, but uh, uh, I'm in in a, in a jam. <laughs> so because there is a a car accident in the in the highway. Mm, yeah, I can see that you're you're um that you're um right now busy. <laughs> yeah. So I uh, will be connected, but I don't know. Okay. No. Able to participate. Mm -hmm. It's okay. That's okay. No problem. As long as um, eh, that you're connected and um, you well, you'll you'll be okay. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Okay. All right. And um, can you know connect to your your laptop or whatever it is that you connect at home as soon as possible. Okay. Yeah. Well. All right. Excellent. How are how are you, Delbert? I'm fine, thanks. Oh, what about you? Pretty good, thank you. Um, um, how how was your day? Yeah, well, I it, it was busy. It was mm. busy. I I work a lot, um, but the time is running fast. Mm. I, I I I feel like uh, uh, I wake up. And suddenly is the noon mm. and and it's, it's time to launch and 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 then it's time to go home mm -hmm. it's, it's, it's really fast mm -hmm. yeah, I can imagine yeah, it's true it um mm -hmm. time goes like this really 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 quickly like uh, yeah. Do yeah, I know, I know. But um the good thing is that this is the last day of the week and and uh we have the weekend. And the body feel it. <laughs> <laughs> the body feels it, yeah. The body knows it. Yeah. Yes. Mm hmm That's true. Um hello Romario. Mm -hmm. Good evening. How are you? Good evening. Happy Hello. It's Friday. Oh, is it raining? No, I'm happy because it's Friday. Oh, I heard <laughs> raining. No. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. I'm a I know. little bit tired because there was a quite exhausting day. I had mm. a lot of meetings. So it's oh. Fast. So but you do not work on Saturdays. No, no. Mm, good. I rest tomorrow. Mm -hmm. Excellent. Very, very good. Very good. Excellent. Um, and uh, what was I gonna say? I forgot. I was, I was gonna ask you something, but I forgot right now. Um. Okay. Excellent. Um. Um. Oh no no no. No, I wasn't gonna ask you something. I was gonna say something. Um, you said that you were you were happy because it's Friday. Do you know what expression we use when we are really happy that it's Friday? Uh, I think it's T G I F. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah, exactly. We say T G I F. Do you know what that stands for? It stands really? for thank, thank God it's Friday. Yeah, exactly. Thank God it's Friday. So we always say T G I F. Actually, there is a a restaurant. I I don't know if there's still if the that restaurant still exists in El Salvador, but I knew there was a restaurant, a T G I F restaurant in. Hello. Uh, uh huh. Uh -huh, the 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 yeah, um, it's still there. It's uh, still Friday. there. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. Exactly. So TGIF. Yeah. Thank God it's Friday. 
Yeah. Uh, and th I want to mention something. Thank God it's Friday. It, I just wanted to mention the fact that it's not thanks God. It's thank God. It's not thanks God. Okay. Without yes. Yeah. It's thank God. Okay. Because it's an imperative. It's like a, it's like saying a da gracias a Dios. It's imperative. Okay. Right. Okay. So yeah. And, and I mentioned this. Yeah. Because many people um, I've heard say thanks God. And it's not thanks God. It's thank God. Yeah. Okay. Excellent. Very good. Uh, hello, Wendy. Hello, too. Hi. How are <laughs> you? Yeah, I'm fine. You're fine. Good. Yeah. Good. good. Yeah. How How yeah. was your day at work today? Mm, my work. Mm -hmm. uh, Oh, other uh, feeling, feeling uh, for me, all American this, Hmm. Yeah, lots of yes. things. Mm. Yes. yes. La, la, no. um, ¿Cómo se dice la semana pasada? Last week. Uh, last, last week. Last week. Eh, I, uh, I, I have. I have vacation. Oh. You had a vacation last week. I had vacation. Yeah. Last week or Four this days. week? Last, last, last week. week or this last coming week. week? No, this this week. No, last week. So okay. Uh, or, March, or... March, uh, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. Mm. Yes. Um, Sunday was uh, uh, 20. 20. <laughs> mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. Yes, I I traveled traveled to Ruatan. To Ruatan? Yes. <laughs> oh, wow. Ooh, Look at beautiful. you. Beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Yeah. Very nice. Yeah. Okay. Very, very, yeah. Yeah, very, very, very nice ho hotel and, and travel. Oh, beautiful. Mm. <laughs> yes. I can only imagine. Yeah, yeah. I've, I've, I've always wanted to go to Roatan. I never had the opportunity, but maybe one day. Actually, you know what? Really? Um, yeah. Um, I I sell. <laughs> I uh, sell the bucket. <laughs> yeah. Maybe one Trouble. day when I'm when I'm back <laughs> when I'm back over there in El Salvador, maybe I'll, I'll 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 go. Actually, you know what? To be honest, maybe I wouldn't go to Roatan. I think I would prefer to go to Tela. Ah, um, Tela. yeah. Because I, mm -hmm. I am not, I am not, not know, uh, no, no Tela. Mm -hmm. uh, other, uh, other customers, other clients, mm -hmm. uh, they save me. Tela is beautiful. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they they yeah. they tell me that Tela is just as beautiful as Ruatan, but mm -hmm. it, it's cheaper, and there are not that many tourists. Yeah. That's yeah. what I, that's what I've heard. So, 
I, I've heard that it's better to go to Tela than to Ruatan. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Tela is, is uh, go, no. uh, near? Mm -hmm. It's near, it's near Ruatan. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. And yeah, that, that's why if they say that it's like just as beautiful because it's it's pretty much the same beach, right? Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. yeah. Exactly. The sea is, is very not uh, Pacific. Pacific. Mm -hmm. it's, it's in Atlantic, but, but it's Pacific. <laughs> the, mm -hmm. the sea is Pacific. It's more Pacific. <laughs> mm. I haven't actually seen yeah. the the um the, the yeah. map. How do, but... how do you say hola? How Waves. Do you say hola? Waves. Waves. Uh, in Roatan, um, it it's not. How do you say? No hay olas. <laughs> there are no waves. There are no waves. No. Yeah. There are no waves. Yeah, I know. Yeah, very, very calm yeah. sea. In, in El Salvador, more waves, more waves. <laughs> yeah, it's exactly. Not, yeah. In, it's different. Yeah. Very different. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. It's very, very, very different. Experience is different. Yeah. 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 That's good. Well, I'm, I'm glad that you enjoyed yourself, Wendy. It's, it's nice to be able to have a a vacation and go somewhere different. <laughs> yes. Mm -hmm. yeah. uh, only four days? It's very four days. <laughs> mm, yes. Sometimes four days is is better than than a long like sometimes it's better to go for a short vacation and come home and rest. Because sometimes yeah. when you go for a long vacation, when you come back home, you are more tired than when you came when than when you left. So <laughs> it's true. Yeah, that that's what happened to me last time. I was like, I went on a on a vacation. It was like, it was like almost a month. It was a month long vacation, and um, I was so exhausted afterwards. So yeah, and sometimes it's better short vacation. Yeah. Okay. Uh, hello, Jennifer. Hi, good evening. Good evening. How are you? Um, well, it was a very tough week mm. and I'm still working. Um, but mm. uh, yeah, yeah, it's, it's a very hard okay. yeah. week, and um, but I don't work uh, on weekends. Mm, and then okay. uh, yeah, I prefer to stay late today, and it have really time off on on weekends. Yeah, yeah, you're right. Yeah, I get it. it yeah, it makes sense. Yeah, but um, I I appreciate that you're connected, even though um you're still working. So thank you. Um, hello, Susana. Hello, Chair. Good evening. Good evening. How are you? Hi, fam. Good, good. I'm glad to hear that. How was your day? Um, eh, it's a hot, hot air. <laughs> mm. It's a hot uh, It's mm. a... I, I take a shower. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yes, it's a... Oh. But it's a uh, I cooking, I cooking pupusas <laughs> for oh. my for my father, father, and my son. <laughs> Don't make me jealous, Susana. <laughs> <laughs> yes, that's not fair. <laughs> pupusa from Ayote. How oh. do you say Ayote? Yeah. <laughs> Ayote that's with the chick. Eh, ¿Cómo es? ¿Queso? Chic, ¿verdad? No, cheese. Cheese. Ah, okay. Cheese, yeah. Uh -huh. 
So squash and cheese. Mm. Ah, squash. No, squash. 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 All right. Squash. Yes. Squid cheese. Squash. 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 Squash and cheese. Ah, okay. Squash. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Squash and cheese. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. Oh, that's yeah. I love squash. Uh, squash pupusas. They're the best. Oh. Well, if if you, yeah, yeah. If you know how to make them, oh, they're really really good. <laughs> yeah, excellent. Yeah. Well, um, <laughs> I was about to. I was about to say. I was about to talk to you in, in Turkish. I'm sorry. Um, I was gonna say, um, enjoy your enjoy your meal. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. And uh, hello. Let me see who else. I haven't said hi to Suleyma. Are you there? Yes, teacher. Good night. Good evening. Good evening. <laughs> Are you okay? Um, what are this? Yeah. Right. Are you are you are you better now or not not in so much? Mm -hmm. No, so much. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry to hear that. Yeah, but I'm 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 happy that you're connected. Right. So thank you. Yeah. yeah. And um, Manuel, hello. Hello, teacher. Good evening, everybody. Good evening. How are you? I'm fine, teacher. Good, good. Nice. <laughs> Very good, good. I'm glad to hear that. How was your day? Okay. Uh, this day, I I had a, a lot of a lot of work. <laughs> Because uh, my workmate mm -hmm. uh, he is um, day off, mm. uh, and it's Friday, and the and the body now is. <laughs> oh. <laughs> but uh, yes, uh, usually uh, or sometimes uh -huh. uh, Fridays are so 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 hard but uh, in other uh, in other time mm -hmm. other time mm -hmm. it's a a little quiet but mm. today it was hard <laughs> mm. yes i i am feeling a little tired and i i think myself uh, get or not get the class <laughs> stay or not stay oh but i was the i was working in the platform and, and said uh, I, I i i made i made yes i i may stay in the class <laughs> mm, well i'm glad yes. that you i'm glad that you decided to to be in the class Right, so thank you. Thank you for connecting. I appreciate that. Okay, and Jorge Humberto, are you, are you there? Mm, not sure. It's Friday, yeah. teacher. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there are very few students. My goodness. Okay. Well, we're going to start with the attendance. So, um, okay, so we're going to start with that. So if you guys um, can open up your microphone as soon as you hear your name. Um. Okay, so we're going to start with Cristia. No? No, Cristia? Okay. Uh, Delbert? Here, teacher. Wonderful. Uh, Diana Elizabeth? 
No, Diana Elizabeth. Okay. Jennifer Elizabeth. Here. Excellent. Thank you. Jorge Humberto. Jorge Humberto. Jorge Humberto, are you there? Manuel Antonio. Present teacher. Okay, wonderful. Um, eh, Maria Elena. Maria Elena Guadalupe, no, right? Okay, Mario Ernesto. Mario Ernesto. Good evening. Okay, ah, hello. Welcome. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, great. Um, Mario Jose. I'm here, teacher. All right, thank you. Normal Carolina. Norma Carolina. No. Uh, Romario Camaliel. Present. All right, Present. wonderful. Silvia Suleima. Present. Excellent. And uh, Susana Beatriz. Present teacher. Excellent. And Wendy Maribel. Present teacher. All right. Excellent. Um, okay. All right. Perfect. Thank you, guys. So we are going to start um, our class. Uh, with, well, first of all, let me see. Um, please tell me if you can see my PowerPoint. Yes, we can. Perfect. Okay, so yes, okay. wonderful. Thank you. So this is a uh, course, the English for Work Program, Advanced Module 2. This is, uh, and your teacher is, or your facilitator is Joseph Guerrero. And today is March 24th, 2023. So, um, so yesterday, let's take a look at what we saw yesterday. So this was, yesterday we talked about at the end of the class, how to use commas to set up uh, parenthetical information. And we discussed the parenthetical information or par the parenthetical element is information that can be removed without changing its essential, the essential meaning of a sentence. Um, okay, so that's what we're, that's what we're going to be looking at. That's that's what we're going to be trying to identify, okay? If there is a parenthetical element, and what that means is that um, it's information that can be removed without changing um, the essential meaning, okay? Um, another name for parenthetical element is added information or additional information. So that means that we don't need that information to complete the sentence. It's just extra information. Okay, think of it that way, extra information. Something that it could be like an opinion. It can be um, like a, a transitional word, right? So a word that that connects the last sentence to this sentence or the last paragraph to this paragraph, or it can be like a relative clause um, that is giving me information about something. Okay, so example, we saw that here, um, cultural diversity in a company, so they say, is indeed a necessity to further improve growth. So here we talked about that so they say is the parenthetical element. 
happy. Why? Because we don't need this information. If we wanted, we could simply eliminate it like this and it'd be okay. We can say the sentence is fine if I say cultural diversity is in a company is indeed a necessity to further improve growth. And it'd be okay. There'd be absolutely nothing wrong with that. Okay, so that's how we know that that is a parenthetical element because we don't need it. What this is, is like an opinion. So they say, it's like when you say in Spanish, um, uh, 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 it's like saying something like, um, uh, así dicen, or, um, how would you say that in Spanish? I mean, you guys can give me an idea how, what would you say that origin like in Spanish? Eh, así que ellos dicen. Um, it's like saying like a sentence like, se dice. Se dice. Right, so cultural diversity in a company. So la diversidad de cultura en una compañía um, se dice eh, es, um, es uh, de hecho una necesidad para, eh, para mejorar el crecimiento. So se dice. It's not necessary to say se dice, right? So, it's so that's 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 why the so they say is not necessary, because it's just my, like the people's opinion. As simple as that. Does that make sense? Yeah. Yes, yeah. Okay. Good. Good. And. We separate the the parenthetical element by using two commas before the parenthetical element and after it. The same thing goes for this over here. So we have um, uh, take for example the activities in which employees participate that facilitate understanding and tolerance of differences for example, is not necessary. Okay, it's not necessary. A, because for example, is just a way to connect the, the sentence before to the sentence. So when you say for example, it's because in the last sentence, you were saying some information and now in this sentence, you're giving it an example. So we don't really need it. It's just, it's a, it's a sentence to connect, but it's not necessary to complete the meaning of it. So once again, we can, if we wanted to eliminate it, okay? But a, if we're gonna use it, we're going to have to put the commas before and after. The same thing here. In a fast-changing world, where the ability to, in to innovate is now recognized as the main competitive edge, companies must seek to create more diverse teams. So over here, the parenthetical element is this part here. All of this part is not necessary. Why? Because what the only reason why we're using, the only reason why we're using this is because we're giving extra information, let's say, about the fast changing world. We're describing it. Okay, we are yeah, we're giving more information about it, but it's not necessary to. We can easily say in a fast-changing world, 
companies must seek to create more diverse teams. Okay, and then would it be okay? So once again, we set aside the parenthetical element using commas. Okay, so how do we identify it? How do I, we identify if it's a parenthetical element or not? Well, basically, um, try de de deleting the word or phrase to see whether the information it provides is merely supplemental or if it's truly necessary. Okay, that's how you're gonna identify it. So eliminate it. If, you, if you're not sure, if you're not sure, if you need it, eliminate the information. And if you can eliminate it and the sentence still makes sense, then it's parenthetical element. But if you delete it, if you eliminate that part and the sentence is like, if you feel like something's missing, like you need some more information, it's because it's essential and you cannot uh, eliminate it. And therefore, it's not a parenthetical element and you're not going to be using commas in between. Does that make sense? Pretty simple? No. <laughs> it's not, not as simple as 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 because there are some sentences as the first one and the second one that that is kind of easy to identify that para, parenthetical uh, uh, words. Mm -hmm. But for example, I was working on the platform and I have just one missing sentence that I can uh, set the commas and so identify the parenthetical, parenthetical um, phrase or words. Mm -hmm. That's that is as uh, I try it different combination because first try to identify the sentence that I need to to put between commas mm -hmm. or the words between commas and then and and it was wrong and then I start to 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 test different sets of words but any of that I test it works at least not for me okay then if it's if you cannot eliminate the information it's because there is no parenthetical element the information is essential if you sure. yeah if, if it and doesn't then make sense. I, I i i i remove the commas and i copy and paste mm -hmm. the same sentence and it doesn't work mm. also. okay but yes. remember that's that's exactly what we're that we're going to have a class for because you're going to be able to work with a partner and to or with yeah with you with partners and be able to work together and sometimes two heads or three heads work are better than one right so that's why it's good to share your different opinions with your classmates and then maybe it will be easier for you later so that's exactly what we're going to be doing right now okay okay all right manuel you had a question or a uh, comment yes uh, other uh, to uh, jennifer uh, i think uh, sometimes the platform had a had a, a, a issues with a point with a I don't know because uh, I had the I had the same problem. It's like Jennifer, I tried to different ways mm -hmm. combination, but mm -hmm. uh, and nothing, nothing mm -hmm. except the the the, the exercise. Mm -hmm. Yo, uh, only only the number one in the one point nine three uh, work homework. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But I think it's a problem with the platform teacher because the next 
uh, homework or exercise, uh, I, uh, I had uh, one problem also with uh, only, only exercise, but in order, uh, it means uh, a point when you put uh, that, uh, I, I don't know, uh, how do you say punto, punto final? Period. Period, period okay. Uh, it means the, the period, when you put the period, yes, okay, uh, 15, get the, mm -hmm. get, get our, our, our okay, the, like, like okay, the, the exercise. I think it's a, a platform. It could be. Yeah, it, it, it could be. But um, yeah, so we're, we're going to work on it together right now. So okay, don't, thank you. don't, um, don't stress right now over it. Okay. Because okay. that's, we haven't really worked on the exercises yet. So you know. we can get that, that, that time, that, that, that the 100 percent teacher. <laughs> yes, we will. Don't worry. We will. We need to get. <laughs> yeah, we will. We will. Okay. So um all right so our exercises are these ones okay so it says read the following sentences and identify whether or not so notice whether or not so it it could be it could be that it has a parenthetical elements and it could be that it doesn't whether or not they feature parenthetical information Set off the parenthetical information from the rest of the sentence, applying proper punctuation. That means commas, in other words, right? Because that's that's the only way that we're going to be using proper punctuation. So we're using the commas. And comparing answers with the partner. So I'm going to get you guys to work in small groups, in groups of two or three, okay? Um, and uh, see what happens, okay? And so... Let me first, uh, do, you, do you guys have the, the exercises there? If not, I will, I will copy, I will copy and paste. I'll send it right now in the group. Oh, actually, okay. So I'll send it in a moment. And right now I'm gonna make the groups. Okay. Um, so just wanting to make sure. Um okay. Mario uh Mario Jose. Are you there? Mario Jose? Mario Jose uh, was uh, driving. Yeah, that's but I, I see he's connected, so I'm not sure if he's okay. if he's no, okay. Mario Ernesto. Are you there? Hello, Mario Jose. Fernando. Oh, oh. Yes, hello. Uh, just, I, I'm still driving, so. Okay, you're still driving, okay. And, and Mario Ernesto? Mm -hmm. Yes, teacher, I'm here. You're here, okay. Uh, I can't see you. Ah, perfect, okay, gotcha, thank you. Okay, all right, so. Um, what's up? Okay, just a second. What do you have next? What do you have next? Okay, um, so I'm going to give you. 10 minutes to work on this. Yeah. Okay. If you need more time, don't worry because I will I will give you guys more time. Okay. So let's open the rooms.
Eh, All right, there you go. I'm sending you. Todo. Parece que los gringos algunos hablan rápido, otros así entre lengua y ese es el challenge. Bien. Hay que entenderles a todos. Pa. Yes. <risa> yes. Yo, yo ya yo... hice la plataforma, yes. pero igual sí me dio error. <risa> yo igual me da error la última, no la puedo. Ninguna me salió última. buena de los. Ni una de las... Entonces, lo que pasa es que no habían entendido. Eh, Solo vamos una... a preguntar a la teacher ahorita. Eh, ¿Cuál ah, es el, el, lo que vamos a hacer ahorita en el grupo? Porque ahí no ahí mandó las 1.9 de, de, de eso de, mismo de es. Sí. Permítanme, permítanme. De, de, let me check the yes yes y de y de 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 side of platform. But uh -huh. eh, when you eh, let me let me tell you when you eh, understand the the main idea like teacher was uh, was uh, mm, explaining explaining uh, is a uh, uh, is a uh, a little easier to realize to solve this for you is <laughs> no 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 yeah. really but you need you need to understand uh, oh. You need to understand, teacher. What is the uh, we can, uh, we need to solve the in group the the exercise? The exercises, yes. Ah, oh, exactly. Okay, okay, okay. Very good. Uh, I I I am uh, checking. And then we are uh, discuss uh, uh, if uh, all uh, will be agree or disagree. <laughs> okay. Okay. Yeah. The number one, I I I have not the uh, I have not been solved because in the platform there isn't. But I in the in the in the yes in the platform but in the in the student manual yes for example uh, the number one please uh, read uh, Susie okay read the number uh, one the research the research of benefit. It, it, it wouldn't change much. The third one says differences in interpretation interpret interpret of events composition among employees who speak a different language can lead to here. Here, it, we can give. I'm almost sure we can erase this. I don't want issue about this language. This would be something by very core information. Diversity when it works increases profits for a company. Yeah. When it works. When it works. I'm not sure about these ones, but it's for me the fourth is clear. But a culturally diverse workforce opposite to its counterpart better understands diverse markets. Maybe it's opposite its counterpart. A culturally diverse workforce better understands diverse markets. 
the best way to achieve a productive and diverse environment is not just leadership by example, but the use of its uh, strategies. Here by example. Well, I know what we got. I think it's right or we can modify something. It's a little bit insane. Well, I think it has sense. In my case, I'm not sure that the topic. The, the first one. Whole topic, I don't know. The topic. Yes. Well, we're we're learning about parenthetical information. That is information that is not uh, purely necessary to give a meaning to the whole sentence. So we could erase it and the meaning wouldn't be uh, affected. So um, usually it is between commas, but in this case, maybe because the teacher is, is putting us in, in test and there are no commas, but we can read it and there are some words or phrases that are not completely necessary. I guess the number one don't have, have, have any. Number one, the reserve. Uh -huh. yes. yes. We can change the color for for blue, maybe, <laughs> to make it two. <laughs> so it's like uh, we have, well, for me, we could erase it and it wouldn't affect, but uh, it could be, a, I understand that it could be a, a interesting or a, yeah, interesting uh, information to, to know what, which year it, it was publicate, published. I don't know, so. but I guess that, that the exercise, this exercise is the same in the, in the, in the homework. One point seven or one point nine, I guess is the same. I haven't done the, the homework yet, <laughs> so I don't, know. I don't know. Okay. With that. Yes, uh, I'm. I'm not. Let me see. It was. It's not just leadership, for example. Yeah, that is, I, I, no. I don't know. So, I give up. No. And then, The best way to achieve a productive and diverse environment is not just leadership. I think that is correct. And by example, is could be additional information. But I think that is important the use of detailed strategies. Mm -hmm. But I added also that in, in the platform and it doesn't work. Example, and added to commas. Please. 
Yes, adding two commas. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I don't know if, if, if it's, this is a problem with the space too. Yes, uh, I added, I removed the space because after comma should be a space. Nothing. No, no, it doesn't work. It doesn't work. Teacher, are you there? I am. No, we filed yeah, teacher, I need to. Yeah, I need to disconnect and switch to my uh, cell phone, mm -hmm. and then I'm going to connect it right away. Okay. No but I think it's going to disconnect from this uh, break room. Yeah, yeah, it is. Um, all right, so I'll just add you back in. Yeah. Okay. okay. I'm going to disconnect right now. Okay. No problem. We are going to. We are going to to try. Just miss to... one sentence. <laughs> Good. Good. We are going to to try the 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 many many ways, the sentence number one, but. Uh, the 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 other the other ones are so are okay only the the first one we file okay i don't know why okay well we're we're gonna find out what's going on mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and so are you ready um or do you need more i'm going to disconnect right now and i just connect to my and in my cell phone Okay, so I'm sending you right now. So you guys need any more time? No, no. I we we are trying the number one better. I I I try to don't give up, but I don't know how to how to put it the the parent parent parenthetical parenthetical parent parenthetical. Mm -hmm. Okay, well, um, okay, you have still a little bit more time to discuss, okay, I'll, I'm going to go to the rest of the groups and see what, okay. how they're doing. Okay. Verify elements. Identificar que verdaderamente ahí va la coma. Entonces, lea la cuatro, por favor. Diversity. Diversity when it works increase profit for a company. Okay, uh, muy bien. It's good to you 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 read it, but listen. Diversity when it works increase profit for a company. Donde van las comas? Where is the, the, the commas? When it works. Correcto, en medio ahí está. Mira. Diversity uh, when it yeah, works. Ahí está diciendo, la diversidad cuando funciona, o sea, no es necesario, porque dice, la diversidad uh -huh. cuando funciona, incrementa los beneficios para una compañía. Es cierto, o sea, pero... La pero, diversidad o sea, incrementa, funciona. Uh -huh. O sea, no importa, o sea, la diversidad, uh -huh. eh, o sea, si funciona, ya eso es una información adicional, y si es extra information. Uh -huh. O sea, que va la, la coma en Gwen, adelante de Gwen. No, no. No, no. Diversity, ¿cómo? Between diversity, when. Ah, ok. Diversity, diversity when, coma. coma. No, uh -huh. diversity. Diversity. Diversity, diversity. Diversity, diversity, coma. Ajá, correcto. When it Luego, works, coma. Eh, works, coma. Yes. Mm. Yes, work. Yes, number five, a cultural diverse workforce opposite to its counterpart counterpart better understand diverse market okay a culturally diverse workforce opposite to its counterpart better understands diverse markets una fuerza de trabajo con 
eh, diversidad de culturas, le dice ahí, se opone a, a opuesta a su contraparte. ¿Qué dice? Entonces es opuesto eh, a cultural diverse workforce, coma. Ajá, coma, opositive to uh -huh. it. Coma. Oh, Hi guys, are you finished? Are you ready? Yeah, we're finished. Yeah. Um. Okay. Perfect. I will take you back to the main room then in a moment. Okay. Okay, guys. Um, if you guys can turn on your cameras back again, there's some people I cannot see. So, Jennifer, I can't see you. And... Yeah, I remember this connect because I'm in a, uh, connecting to from my cell phone, mm -hmm. but I'm going to uh, connect the uh, uh, turn on my camera in a I think in 10 minutes. Oh, okay. I'm yeah. Okay. And um, Mario Ernesto, are you there? He say say in her job. Mario Ernesto. Yes, Mario. Mm. Okay. Um, all right, guys. Um, even if you were at your job, um, I need you guys to uh, like have your camera on and everything if it's possible. Um, if it's not, well, you know, it's not, but if, if, if it's possible, um, you know, you can turn on your camera on so that it, we, we know that you're there at least, right? Because just just being there and not not knowing what if you're there you're not there it's just um and remember that that we have um we the videos are are audited so um the the when when the people from and so forth audit they have to see that you're there as well right so just um if you can possibly do that for me that'd be great okay um okay so let's um let's start by checking um just give me one second Mm. Um, okay, just 
second. I'm a little confused right now. Mm. Okay, I got it. Okay, so tell me if you can see my PowerPoint. Yes. Yeah. Okay. All right. Perfect. So here we go. So, um, so as we mentioned before, the the way that we're going to be working on this is, you have to identify if there's any part of the sentence that is possible to eliminate. And the sentence would still make sense. That's the very first part we have to do with this exercise. And second, if you if you can't eliminate any part because everything of that every part of that sentence is necessary, you leave the sentence as it is. But if there is a part that can be eliminated, what we're going to do is simply add, we're going to insert commas before the parenthetical element and after parenthetical element. Okay, so um, here we go. Any questions before we begin? No, no, no. No, no questions? Okay. All right, let's start about the first one. The research on benefits of multicultural teamwork and cultural tolerance, which was published last year, has um, shed light on new perspectives for companies to promote cultural diversity at work. Is there anything from this sentence that is extra information that is not necessary for the sentence to exist and make sense. Which was published last year. Good. Okay. This part here, which I'm going to highlight. Oops, sorry. Really bad. Okay. This again. This part right here is not necessary. Why? Well, think of it. If I eliminate that part, and the only thing I say is the research on benefits of multicultural teamwork and cultural tolerance has shed light a new perspective for companies to promote cultural diversity at work. It makes sense. I don't need anything more to complete that sentence, which tells me, that tells me that this information here is extra. What this is really doing is it's giving me more information about the research, okay? So it's just extra information about the research. When was the research published? Last year. But I don't need to know really when it's published because what's important here is the fact that that research has given light or a new understanding of the um, com a, a a new perspective for the companies. That's 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 the most important part. When it was published, how it, like a, all information about the re that that research, when, how, things like that. That's that's extra. I don't need to know that. That's not the most important part. Okay, and. Yeah, so basically that's that's it. Okay, so how are we going to then complete this exercise? Well, we have to put correct punctuation. So what would we have to do? Uh, 
Who the commas? Right. We're going to put commas right here. This is okay. a big comma. <laughs> it is a big comma, and I did it on purpose. <laughs> I did it on purpose so that it was visible. Is it visible? <laughs> okay. And we're going to put another so big so comma. To work in this PowerPoint. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Okay, so there you go. Does that make sense? Yes. So far, so good, everybody. Anybody have any questions? Does everybody see that mm -hmm. this this part is a parenthetical element? Can you identify that? Yes. Yeah. Wendy, does that make sense for you? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Wendy? Does, yes? does it make sense to you? Yes or no? I don't understand your question. D does this information here make sense for you? Tiene sentido? Yes. Oh. <laughs> no. Yes or yes, no? Makes sense. So, Wendy, I, I want to know do you understand this? No. Okay. No. But tell, okay, tell me in Spanish what is the part that you don't understand? You can tell me in Spanish. Me confunde qué parte debe de ir entre paréntesis o qué parte es la que debe ir en coma. Vale, pero mi pregunta es esta. Este ejercicio ahorita que acabamos de hacer, la explicación que le acabo de dar, ¿tiene sentido para usted? que no entiendo mucho. Ok, ¿qué parte no, no o sea, ¿Qué parte de lo no, que yo le he explicado no, no tiene mucho sentido? No, o sea, sentido puede tener, pero no entiendo, no, o sea, no entiendo. Este ejercicio no lo he entendido. No me sale en la plataforma y no lo entiendo, no lo termino de entender bien. Ok, explíqueme qué es lo que le acabo de, 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 de lo que yo acabo de explicar. Explíqueme qué es lo que usted ha entendido. Yo entiendo de que va entre paréntesis, o sea, esa información es como extra y que aunque no esté esa información, supuestamente lo demás entiende. Eh, algo así. Uh -huh. Muy bien. ¿Por Pero qué? cuál es la, esa información es lo que me cuesta como descifrar. Bye. Which was published last year? How would you say that in Spanish? Which was published last year? Uh, Sorry, when can you repeat? Cada publicación del año pasado. No. Which was published last year means el cual fue publicado el año pasado. El cual fue publicado el año pasado. So, el cual fue publicado, el cual, estamos hablando de la investigación. Le estoy dando información acerca de la investigación. So, I'm giving you extra information about when the, the research was published. I don't need to know when it was published. That information is not necessary. So, 
how to identify, it's quite, well, for example, in this sentence, it's not too difficult because, first of all, we need to identify the subject. What is the subject? Can somebody tell me what the subject of the sentence is? Mm -hmm. Cual? No. El cual? No. The, sen the, the sentence. The subject, uh, I think, is the research on benefit of multicultural teamwork and cultural tolerance. Good. All of this is a subject. It's not just the research, because th the part of on benefits of multicultural teamwork and cultural benefits, sorry, cultural tolerance, okay. that that is in uh, that is being more specific of what research we're talking about. Okay, it's not just any research. We're, we're talking about which research, the one on benefits and multicultural teamwork and cultural tolerance. That information is important. We need to know what kind of research it is. So all of this is part of the subject. Okay? Does that make sense? I think, I think I'm going to make this one smaller. Yes, it should make sense. <laughs> Okay, uh, Wendy, do you understand that this is a subject? No, lo siento, creo que eso no voy a entender nada más. No, 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 no. Intentaré. Okay, okay. No, no, lo primero que tiene que hacer es quitarse la idea de que yo no puedo entender esto. Porque si, si usted... Dice desde el principio, yo no, yo no voy a nunca a entender esto, entonces nunca lo va a entender porque usted misma se está poniendo la, la, el obstáculo. Usted diga, no, yo esto lo, 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 voy a, lo voy a entender y usted va a ir viendo cómo poco a poco se le va a ir eh, aclarando las cosas. Pero quiero que usted trabaje conmigo. Do you see that this is a subject? Can you understand that this is a subject, Wendy? Todo eso es el sujeto. Yes. Do you do you see do you see that? Uh -huh. sí. This is okay. Sí. Okay. Okay. Vamos bien, ¿verdad? Eh? Wendy, you understand this is a subject. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Good. Yes. What goes after the subject? ¿Qué sigue? ¿Qué sigue después de un sujeto? Siempre. Good. Excellent. Very, very good, Wendy. <laughs> the verb. We need a verb. Question. Do we have a verb after? Is there a verb? Which was published? No. No. This is not a verb. Where is the verb? No. Where's huh? what was that? Huh? Has what? Has shed. Has shed. Has shed. Has shed. Yes. That's the the verb. Has shed. Remember, subject and verb. We always put the subject okay. with the verb. Okay? Yes? yes? Okay. So okay, yes. here is the verb. Ah, but in this case, the subject and the verb are not together. That tells me that whatever is between the subject and the verb, this is extra information that I don't need. This information here is extra because it's what this is doing is that it's giving me information about the subject. 
giving me extra information about the subject. That's mm -hmm. why that's why it's separating the subject and the verb. But in reality, we need to have the subject and the verb together. Do you see that, Wendy? Does that make sense now to you? Wendy? Does that now make sense for you? Wendy, tengo una, una, una inquietud. Usted, usted me puede escuchar bien. ¿Usted puede escuchar bien la clase? O sea, eh, logra escuchar bien porque en su, en su entorno escucho bastante ruido. Entonces, no sé si es que el problema es que no escucha bien la clase. ¿Será eso el problema? No, teacher. ¿No? Pero, no. pero sí puede escuchar bien. Sí, sí. O, o, o le está. ¿Tiene distractores alrededor? No, no, como tengo el audífono. Ok. No. Ok, va, ok, muy bien. Ok, bye. ¿Ha, ¿Ha logrado captar lo que le estaba explicando del subject y el verbo? Sí, entre el sujeto y el verbo hay algo como esta información y esa es la, eso es lo que, como que está de más, algo así. Yes, exactly, yes, okay, because, because the subject and the verb need to go together. And so if the subject and the verb don't go together, there's something happening there. And you can identify, ah, there's extra information there. Okay? Is that, is that good, Wendy? Yes? Yes. All right. See, you understand. See? See? Ya, ya ve que no, 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 no debe decir, no, yo no entiendo esto. You can. You can understand it. You just have to be patient, but you can understand it. Okay? All right. Okay. Okay, good, good. Let's continue with the next one. Inclusion in inclusion initiatives in most workplaces are usually poorly funded and disconnected from broader general training programs. Is there anything here that sounds like it's extra information? In most work workplaces? Um, which initiatives? Yes, yes, very good. Um, and once again, we have the same situation here where we have the verb. Sorry, sorry, this, this, the subject and the verb here. So we have the, the subject is inclusion initiatives, right? And where is this, where is the verb? R, right? Uh, exactly. So there is a gap. There's something in between there that is extra. Okay? And so that tells me that this is the parental... Um, Sorry, the, the parenthetical element right here. Okay. And in order to set aside the parenthetical element, we're going to have to put comes. How is this working out for you guys? Do we understand this? Mm 
Yes, no? Yes, teacher. I, w I want to hear everybody's opinion because um, sometimes I know some people um, don't say anything because they are a little shy or maybe they feel afraid that maybe they're the only ones that that don't understand it but that's why I'm asking I want everybody's opinion tell me is there something that is not clear I understand teacher yeah yeah for, for me it's clear it's clear as well okay Okay, all right, let's go on to the next one. Differences in interpretation of elements, a common issue among employees who speak a different language can lead to miscommunication. Is there anything here that could be extra? A common issue among employees who speak a different language. Good, good. A common issue among employees who speak a different language. There you go. Okay. How do we know? It's very simple. I've given you the clue. Uh, I've given you the, the key there. First of all, we identify the subject. What is the subject? Difference in interpretation of event. Yes, the inference is in, in interpretation of events. That's the subject. Where's the ver where's the verb? Can. Can what? Can lead. Can lead. This is the verb. You will see that there is a gap. The subject and the verb need to be together, and there's a gap there. So that tells me that this information is extra. It's actually information that's a, it's additional information that's giving me information about the subject. Okay, so that means that we're going to be adding the commas. Teacher, yeah. Uh, 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 without all a sentence uh, like a parenthetical element, uh, I think is a, uh, I think a difference in interpretation of events uh, is, is, is not necessary to add this part. I think because uh, for, for, for there are a difference of uh, or or issues. For example, when a diff when a people uh, have a, a a a wrong interpretation, it is necessary that people speak other a uh, different language, right? Uh, even though if in the company, in a, in a company, there are people that they speak the, the same language. Maybe it could be the problem of uh, the miscommunication. Mm -hmm. You know, necessary they speak different language, right? Because I consider this is a, a this is a parenthetical element. Yeah. It's not necessary. Right. Exactly. So differences in interpretation of events. I um so if is from what I understand what you're saying is yes. is that it's not necessary to have to speak a different language yes. in order to have differences in interpretation of events. Yes. That means that when I say a common issue among yes. employees who speak a different language, that means that I'm just telling you, these employees also have 
this problem, but they're not the only ones, right? So, yeah. so what we're really discussing here is not the different languages. We're discussing yeah. the interpretation, the differences yeah. in interpretation of events. Yeah. Right. That's the most important thing. The other part just gives me more information about who are some of the people that have differences of interpretation. Right. Yeah, exactly. Very good. Very, very good. So far, so good, everybody. You're understanding this topic. You understand how to identify if there's extra information in there. Yes, teacher, yes, but teacher. I I, yes. I have a stress with the with the last one. <laughs> okay, okay. Yeah, well, look, we're, we're getting there. We're getting there. Okay, let's go on to the number four. Diversity when it works increases prof profits for a company. Diversity when it works when it increases works. for a company. Okay, so you say that it's what? When it's work. When it's work. Okay. Work. All right. So when it works. Oops. Let's change that color. It's too bright. Okay. Oops. <laughs> Sorry. All right. No worries. Okay. How do we know that this is? Well, once again, it's not that difficult. You just have to identify the subject. The subject is? It's like a condition. Diversity. Diversity. Yes, very good. Diversity. And was this was the subject? Diversity. Okay. Diversity is is a subject. So, sorry, sorry, what's the verb? Sorry, what's the verb? Increase. Increases, yeah. Good. Again, there's something in between. That's extra. Why? Because this is actually a, it's an opinion, basically, when it works. Right? So, um, yeah, it's just telling me, oh, sorry, sorry, it's not an opinion. It's a ad adverbial phrase, sorry. It's a verbial phrase. So, it's telling me more information about that diversity. That's it. So that um, that means that I need to separate it with commas. How's this working for you guys? So far, so good. Yes. Any any questions so far? So far. I know there's going to be questions later, but so far, it's okay. Yeah. As they, as they say um, at weddings, speak now or forever hold your peace. You know that? You know that saying, like in Spanish? At what do they say at weddings? Yeah, exactly. So, any questions at this moment? This is the moment to ask questions. This is when I'm here to help you. So, if something is not clear in this moment, this is the moment we can help. We can we can clear anything, any doubts. Okay. Sure. Yes. Is that is in the question I in the sentences is um is a confused, but it's a uh, between work is bear in Christ is bear. Entonces ahí es exactly. que, <laughs> no yeah. podemos confundir. Uh -huh. Yeah. Uh, so but uh, but the thing is that we can't say that works is a verb. You know why? Works cannot be the verb because um, 
if the word would be the verb, then uh, that means that the subject is it. But the subject is not it. The subject is diversity. We can't say we can't say diversity works increases. That doesn't make sense. So this this works has to be part of the parenthetical element. Yeah, does that does that make sense, Susana? No, it's it's okay. It's okay. Yeah. Okay. Uh, All right. <laughs> yeah, so, yeah. So I I understand what you're saying. Yes, it can it can be look a little confusing, but when you look at it a uh, when you look at it closer, it's really not that difficult, because you identify ah, a you know the 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 verb has to be, um, the verb that goes with the subject, right and. In this case, works cannot go with the subject because um, the subject in this case of works is it. It's right beside it. Yeah, so it's not, it's not possible. Okay, let's continue. Mm -hmm. All right, let's continue, continue to number five. A cultural diverse workforce opposite to its counterparts better understands diverse markets. Any ideas? Opposite uh, to its counterpart. Good. Better. Opposites to its counterpart. Counterpart. Uh, sorry. I just don't want it to go more than it should. There you go. Okay. All right. How do we know that this is it? Well, first of all, let's identify. Subject. What's the subject? A, a culturally diverse workforce. Good. A culturally diverse workforce. Yeah. So far, so good? Yes. Okay. What's the subject? Sorry, sir, what's it, the verb? Understand. Understands. Not just understands. Better understand. Better, better understand. Better yeah, understand. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Better understands. Okay. So, again, there's a gap between the subject and the verb. That means that this is extra information. We don't need it. Okay. okay. So far so good, guys. Okay, I'm hoping that we're okay with this. Okay, number six. Um, the best way to achieve a productive and diverse environment is not to just leadership by example, but through the use of detailed strategies. Teacher, I think mm -hmm. uh, uh, all the all the sentence uh, is necessary mm -hmm. to complete the idea. So you think that there is no parenthetical no, element? Yes, there is no parenthetical element. Mm. My last try was the best way because that is not necessary. Uh, if we remove that, we can say to achieve a productive and diverse 
environment is not just leadership by example, but through the use of detailed strategy. But it doesn't work also. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> yeah, because okay. I think that I like is... That is that, Jennifer, yeah. I like. <laughs> yeah, because okay. the best way is, 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 is not necessary as same as we said in most workplaces. Okay. I gave, I gave, I gave up. <laughs> okay, so Jennifer, you said that you think the best way is the the parenthetical element. If the best way is a parenthetical element, that means the subject is what? What is the subject? Yeah. Uh... Well, we're talking about to achieve uh -huh. a productive and diverse environment. I think that is the subject for me. Good. If you think that um, the parenthetical element is the best way, then the subject would be this. Now, do we start subjects with the to infinitive? No. no, 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 no. We don't no. start subject with, yeah. with that. Exactly. So this they can't all... this can't work. That the best way cannot be the parenthetical element then. So what is the subject then? The best way to achieve a product and diverse environment. Good. Exactly. Yeah, it's all. all of this is a subject. What is the verb? It's not just leadership. Well, is is the verb. Right. Is is the mm. verb. Is not, right? Yeah, it's, it's not. not. Right. Okay. Is there any gap in between the subject and the verb? No. 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 So what conclude what's your conclusion? It's not just leadership. By example, it but how did you it doesn't have only before yeah. by example. Doesn't have a parenthetical. As we try that, and the platform doesn't accept it. That's I don't know it. if that is a mistake, but it is. Yes, I, I try without without par, without commas too. Yeah, we try. <laughs> yeah, okay. the yes, the say I. Okay. When okay. I said the best don't. way, it was my last chain. <laughs> my last okay. try. Okay. Overall. Don't frustrate. Don't frustrate. Yes. Don't don't get frustrated. <laughs> Can I give you the last, uh, the last pointer? So Jennifer, just simp do, just do something for me. Yep. Eliminate the period. Okay. I wanna cry. <laughs> just... <laughs> Why? Yeah, this guy could be. This is yeah. so freaky. Very yeah, pretty. but uh, all 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 other sentences accept the period. Yeah, I know, I know, I know, I know. I know it's sometimes that's hard. the only thing that I didn't try. Es lo único que no entendimos, que no que no intentamos. Get, yeah, es lo único. That is todo see, lo see, that's why you guys need the class. <laughs> en la siguiente van a tener también por ahí alguna duda porque no lleva punto y sí lo necesitan la respuesta. En la siguiente. Yes, I also write the capital letters and also add the 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 period. The period. Yes, because sometimes if we don't uh, I know, I know. Yeah, fill out the the the, the period it also doesn't I know, work. I know, I know, I know it's confusing. I I I, I get it and I, I and I, I, sim I sympathize about with you. 2 hours. I know. All this Exercise. Yeah, I know, I know, but I really appreciate... to confess, I miss, I will miss, uh, uh, um, next. Everybody no. has ten. <laughs> yeah. Are they off? Everybody has the, the level. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. So, so now all everything is okay, right? Life, life is back to normal, right? <laughs> yeah, I can sleep. You can sleep now. Yeah, yes. I can sleep now. Okay, good, good, good. I'm glad to hear that. Okay. Yeah, so thank you. You're welcome.
<laughs> okay. All right, guys. So that is it for that exercise. Um, now we're going to go on to the next part um, of our class, which is your turn. Okay. This is now your turn. So we're going to be working in small groups. We're going to be designing an online poster that presents different aspects of cult culture that are diverse in your workplace. Okay, so we can talk about beliefs, religion, sexual orientation, etc., etc., etc. Anything that makes your workplace a diverse, diverse workplace. Anything at all. Okay, a things that that um, a elements that can create a melting uh, a, a melting pot. Okay, now you're going to organize a presentation to explain how the differences you present in the chart influence whether positively or negatively, negatively or both. The performance and interaction of those work mix with the other employees. Okay, so you're gonna first identify what are the different aspects that um, make your workplace diverse. That's the first thing. Second thing, how those aspects influence whether positively or negatively or both the interaction of all the workplace, the workmates. Sounds good? Is this pretty clear what you're gonna be doing? Yes, no? Me teacher, I, um, I don't understand all the, the first. Okay. A, the next slide will help you to understand. Okay, so you're going to be working with a small group and you're going to be present. This is just an example. This is not the only thing. This is just an example of other things. So how, what aspects make your workplace diverse? We can talk about culture. If there's difference, differences in culture, we can talk about values, right? Um, you know, what values are different? We can talk about things like sexual orientation or um, disability, um, you know, different the aspects that happen in your workplace that make your workplace diverse, anything at all, religion, um, race, ethnicity, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. All of those things that we have talked about in this unit, okay? So you, you um, write them down, you list them, you talk about them, and then we're gonna talk about how those aspects influence positively or negatively among all of the employees. Is that pretty clear for you guys? Or are you a little confused still? Teacher, uh, in fact, we, we, we are going to to discuss or create yeah. a, a conversation with no. no no not a conversation a poster an online poster the number one design yeah. an online poster yeah exactly an online poster so you know um so you're going to create this uh, this poster but it's going to be digital right okay so um a, and, and this is going to be um, talking about all of those aspects. Okay. Religion, mm -hmm. sexual orientation to that. Mm -hmm. Exactly. And then, 
Okay. They're organized in the chat. In the chat. Mm -hmm. the now, you're not going to have time to do everything tonight. Okay? But you can start tonight. And we will continue on Monday. Sounds good? Yes. And when we work on groups, uh, we have to, uh, to put in comments because if we are going to, uh, to work in groups, uh, we have different uh, cultures and religions mm -hmm. and all values and all that. And we, uh, we need to put in comments and make a summary and that are, are we going to, to present. Yeah, exactly. So uh, maybe in my workplace, there are people with disability, but maybe in your workplace there aren't, right? But okay. maybe there are people in your workplace with different religions or in the other classmates, they have people with different um, race, I don't know, whatever, okay? Sounds good? So like I said, yeah, I'm going great, perfect. So like I said, we're not going to finish this, but we're gonna start this today. So I'm gonna be creating breakout rooms. Okay, and and I'm starting now. Please, porque no entendí uh, realidad en la primera parte en qué, qué es lo que vamos a sobre sobre sí sí sé sobre lo que lo que decía Iber pero donde dice online poster no entiendo Okay, so first, right now, just just start um talking. Okay, no, just, talking, just okay. okay, just start with that. Okay. Oh, okay. Okay. About belief, religion, sexual orientation. It about things that um make your workplace diverse. Simple as that. Okay, so just let's start with that. Okay. Okay. Okay, uh, Wendy and Marie, Marie Elena, please. Uh, yes, uh, we are going to to speak or talking about a cultural aspects or divers in, in your workplace. Uh, the question is, uh, there are uh, divers, there are their base, there is diversity in your workplace of culture, diversity of culture. Maybe in our country, no. Culture, values, others. Culture, 
values others. So in my case, but I think there's people from different countries, so the culture sometimes is different. But I don't know how to, to, to put it here. Maybe people different countries. with different, I don't know, that's the idea. Um, in, in my company, they embrace well, I'm going to put my company's name. Gender equality. They try that yeah. the amount of women in, in sub supervisor. Places or positions grow time. So they 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 are they don't make any difference be, between the genders. It means that yeah, they try. We don't speak about the religion too. <laughs> Yeah, in my yeah. workplace, because uh, well, because I have to interview, I do question. I I make questions about that, uh -huh. but only because of that. <laughs> okay, but in my case, imagine when I uh, I speak with the the Russian, I I don't know mm -hmm. about the religion that they. If it's oh. the Islam or something, yeah, or something From like where that, they are, they Russian. are Rus Russian. Rus Russian. Most Russian? Russians are Orthodox. Mm -hmm. Orthodox. Yes, I was going to Google it. <laughs> yeah, oh, most, okay. most, most of them like they would be Orthodox. Mm. Orthodox. Orthodox. Yeah, Orthodox. Yes. Orthodox. Okay. Christianity. Um, mm -hmm. Yes, I, I imagine uh, the Colombian people could be like like us uh, with uh, Catholicism. Catholicism, yes. Mm -hmm. They are very religion or religion. Religiosos. Religious. Uh, but, uh, okay. I imagine we can. Uh, mm -hmm. And they, they, uh, they, I don't know if they prefer, but I think that it is more important for them the Thanksgiving than Christmas because for Thanksgiving they took from Thursday a day off also the Friday and sometimes uh, until until Monday okay. and for Christmas just the, the day also for New Year's and uh, Thanksgiving Day is uh, off in your company. No, no, not for me. <laughs> it's just for them. <laughs> it's just for mm. for them in the United States. Mm. And here we need we 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 work. We don't have the same holidays as they have in the United States. We have holidays 
Okay. Um, just the one in El Salvador. Okay. Where do you work, Jennifer? It's a... Uh, hold on a second, please. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry. Um, it's an American company. Um, but it's... Uh, it, uh, yeah. There is an American company, but uh, the main uh, the main company or the the well, sometimes we call the mothership. It is in in United States, mm -hmm. and here in El Salvador, it's just the production department. Mm -hmm. Okay, it's not a call center as as uh, they have the the the, um, the customer support. It's manuf here. manufacturer. No. No, we are a software developer company. Mm, okay. But for for us, it's the production department, right? The development department is here, and have human resources also for here in El Salvador because it's different from uh, United States. Okay. Uh, but uh, hello. Hello. Yes. Hi. Hello. What happened? ¿Qué pasó? No, no oigo. No oigo que estén discutiendo nada. ¿Qué pasó? Hola Wendy, María Elena. Wendy, María Elena. Hello. Hola. ¿Qué pasó? No, no están, de, no están hablando, no están trabajando juntas. No. ¿Mm? ¿Qué pasó? Estoy separada. ¿Cómo? Wendy, eh, tiene su micrófono apagado. No se le escucha. No, estoy separada. Estamos, estamos trabajando. ¿Están trabajando? Las dos juntas. Ajá. Es que no se les oye que están hablando. Por esa pregunta. Ok, well, in that case, continue. Thank you. Elena. Yes, Wendy. No. No, la veía. Yes. If I, I open, if I open my camera, um, my cell phone is uh, done. Uh -huh.
Okay, guys. Um, so like I said, I know you're not finished, but um, that's all the time we have right now. So we're going to continue this on Monday, okay? Put you back into your groups. So quickly, we'll do attendance. Um, Cristia? Cristia? No. Delberth? Delberth? Sorry, I'm here. Okay, I'm here. wonderful. Sorry. Yeah, no problem. Diana Elizabeth? Present. Okay. Um, Jennifer mm -hmm. Elizabeth? Here. Okay. Jorge Humberto? Jorge. Present, teacher. Okay, great. Manuel Antonio? Manuel Antonio? Eh, María Elena? María Elena? Present, teacher. Okay. Uh, Mario Ernesto. Present, teacher. Great. Uh, Mario Jose. Present, teacher. Great. Norma. Norma Carolina. Carolina, no, right? From Mario Camaliel. Present. Great. Silvia Suleima. Present. Great. Um, Susana Beatriz. Present teacher. Great. And Wendy Maribel. Present teacher. Okay, wonderful. All right, guys. So that will be all. Remember to work on the platform and finish off this weekend. And I will stay with Jorge Humberto. And that will be it. I will see you guys on Monday. Have a wonderful weekend, guys. Okay, enjoy your weekend. Thank, Thank you. you. Bye. You. Thank you. Have a good day. Enjoy the weekend. Thank you. Bye. 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 Thank you, everyone. Bye. 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 Good night. Hello, Jorge. Hello, teacher. Hi. How are you? Kind of tired. I had to drive in from San Miguel to here, San Salvador. Mm, wow. How long did it take you? Uh, three hours and 30 minutes. Three hours it's and 30 minutes. It's in the border, it's in the border with Honduras. Wow. The name is San Luis de la Reina. San Luis de la Reina. San Luis de la Reina. Oh, wow. Yeah, that <laughs> sounds far. <laughs> wow. Yes. And, uh, but you only go there once in a while, right? You don't go there all the time. No. Mm. Uh, yes. Uh, in, this, in this moment, I, I had to to arrive with my car but uh, normally uh, there are uh, a bus oh. of the company that uh, is in charge to move all the employees of the company oh okay okay that well that's good at, at least normally you don't have to be worrying about driving and all yes because i can sleep when uh, when I'm going in the in the bus. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah, so it's a little more relaxing that way. Yes. Yeah, I get it. Okay, and um, how are you doing there with the the platform? Uh, I had problem with two of the of the part of the platform. I don't remember the name, the number, but uh, I remember the 1.9 is about one, the- One what? The gerunds, 1.9. Okay, 1.9, uh-huh. Are you sure 1.1? One one? The, the other one is the about the gerund. Okay, hold on. 1.9 is the one that we have been working on. 
the 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 exercises uh, that we did today are nine one yes but I, but I was um, in the cell phone and then my reception has some kind of problem but uh, in that in that part of this the the platform mm -hmm. I just can complete two of them okay have you tried with the answers that we talked about in class today? Uh, actually, no. Okay. So try that. Try it with the answers from... So, sorry, I, 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 I'm not sure if I understood correctly. You said that you had problems with your phone. Are you talking about now, like during the class? Yes. Uh, now... Now in the in the class, I I can hear all the, the that part. Okay, okay, all right. So, okay, let's do something then. Um, what you can do is, um, during like tomorrow, tomorrow morning, the video will be available on the in the platform and on YouTube. Go back, see the video the complete video so you can get the explanation and try those exercises that you're having problems with. Try with the answers that we've we've been looking at. And if you still are having problems, write in the in the WhatsApp group. Okay. Uh, yeah, I, I imagine the, the problem, I'm not sure if it's a problem with the, the platform, but uh, uh, both uh, the gerund and the and the parenthet parenthetic parenthetical part of the sentence mm -hmm. that it doesn't work in the in the platform. I, I'm not sure if if I was or I made the the mistake, but the answer is was grown mostly of them. Mm -hmm. Yeah, okay. So like I said, um, maybe because you weren't able to hear the majority of the class, maybe it's still a little fuzzy, but go back, watch the video, and try it with the explanations that were given in during the class. And if that you know, if it it should work, it should work. But if it still doesn't work, then you can write to me in, in the WhatsApp group or write to me directly, whatever you prefer, and ex explain. You know, I, I'm having trouble with this, and I will, I will give you pointers as to what you can you can do to to change the answer. Okay, all right. Okay. So so that's about one point nine. What about the gerund? You were you said something that you had problems with the gerund. Yes, I, I have I had problem with gerund because uh, gerund is about adding ing, mm -hmm. but uh, but when I put that uh, that letters in the in the verb, it doesn't work. I'm not sure if I can to change the the base or the structure. Okay, but for this, I need to know what exercise you're talking about. So, if you can tell me which exercise it is, so I can I can help uh, you. With. If uh, could be tomorrow morning because I. I I don't have the, the the computer right now. Okay, I, I was saying it because this I can this is like the opportunity you have to to ask me questions and everything. Mm -hmm. But um, yeah. So I was I was hoping to be able to help you right now. But uh, you can ex try to explain me why the in in the platform the exercise is not only. Uh, change the base form of the verb, adding ing. Uh, 
it's it not is just it is the gerund the, the gerund the gerund is is um done by creating the uh it's actually not a verb gerunds are not verbs they're nouns but they are nouns that are created by using a verb plus an ing mm -hmm. but what about the the verb do you have to change the tense of the verb or no i i, I don't know which exercise you're talking about i so i don't know like I, I could help you to, I could answer that question if I knew which exercise you're talking about, but okay. I don't. So, to, tomorrow I will try to, to first of all see the the, the video, mm -hmm. and then I try, I will try to answer the the, the platform. If okay. I have a problem, I, I, I. I let I let you know. Okay. Okay, that's fine. That's fine then. Okay. So in that case, I will be um uh I will be you know looking at making sure that that um if you have any questions, I will be checking the the, the WhatsApp group. Okay. 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 Well, in that case, um let's uh let's call it a day. And uh, I hope you rest and you have a wonderful weekend. Okay. Thank you. The same All right. to you. The same. Thank you. All right. Bye bye. See you Monday. Bye. See you.